The Taraba State Government is partnering the Ugandan and Cameroonian governments to address the growing trend of mental health in Nigeria through training of medical personnel in government facilities across the country. At a workshop holding in Jalingo, the Taraba State Capital, stakeholders say the target is to develop Africa as a continent through psychotherapy to fight stigmatization. The report. Over the years, one of the most ignored issues of public health in Nigeria is mental health. A study by a health technology company indicates that 80% of Nigerian employees have an increased risk of developing depression. Further discoveries revealed that negative working environment contributes mainly to physical and mental health problems, leading to harmful use of substances or alcohol, absenteeism, and loss of productivity. The low number of psychiatrists across Nigeria and the increasing number of persons coming down with mental health challenges informed why the Taraba State Government is partnering the Ugandan and Cameroon government. What we want to achieve at the end of the day is to make sure that um, we bring the knowledge of mental health um, to all our populace, all our people in Taraba and in Nigeria. Let us know that okay, there is a challenge, there is mental health, and it is not uh, something to be stigmatized against. It is something that we all understand there are challenges that everybody is facing, and so if we all know this, then it will be better for us to be able to seek help when it is getting out of hand. Poor economic conditions, rising cases of illiteracy, marriage crisis, polygamy and large families are some of the factors militating against advancement of individuals' physical and mental well-being. The target is to train 5,000 health workers in Nigeria primary, secondary and tertiary health institutions who will in turn train others to enhance outcomes. There is no health without mental health. So we're here with the Nigerian people to share our knowledge and skills. Because for us in Uganda, for the past 10 years, we developed and evaluated group support psychotherapy as a first line intervention for common mental health problems like depression. We have shown in scientific ways, using rigorous scientific methods, that this psychotherapy effectively treats depression. And not only that, it also improves the physical health of the people and improves the livelihoods of the people. Participants say the training will help them unlock the shadow part of human existence and psychotherapy. I'm happy that we are, we are bringing a lot of mental, I mean a lot of health workers here, you know, to learn about mental health so that they will know how to attend to patients, also know how to attend to ourselves. Because we also need to be mentally healthy to be able to attend somebody who, who has better health challenge. So I'm happy with, with, with this workshop generally. Stakeholders are calling on governments at all levels to make improved investments in health through research, which will lead to a healthy nation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.